lot of fun. Uh, it was cool for me to play with Brock Modem. I've known him since I was nine. My dad used to coach him. Um, and then with a guy like Sean Long as well, who I'd played against here in the NBL. Uh, and then to go over and get to experience uh, a different country style play was really cool. I learned a lot. It's a, it's a lot slower than the NBL. A lot more sets run and less risks taken, uh, which took a bit of time to adjust to for me. But once, once I got into it, it was, it was a good style of play and I, I really enjoyed it. I'd heard lots of good things about Japan from guys that, are, that have been over there and as soon as kind of they came to me and said there was a job there, I was pretty keen to take it up to kind of get my first taste of international basketball and kind of dip my toe in the water and, and see what it's like over there. And, you know, I spoke to Jake and Campbell straight away and they were all like super keen for me to do it. Uh, and for me, I, I just think it helped me you know, learn a whole another style of play and I uh, got a lot of time over there to just really work on my game individually. My shot, I think, came a long way. They're very polite people and you know, they, they were very welcoming when I came over and made it really enjoyable to be there and the food was awesome. I don't know if I can eat ramen in Australia again after having that because that was unbelievable. And the sushi, hibachi, yakiniku places, they were all unbelievable. Uh, the, I think the food was uh, close to some of the best I've had. Oh, I mean, it's huge for me, you know, it's something I've dreamed about since I was a young kid, you know, watching Olympics, uh, watching World Cups. It's still kind of cool to be named in the squad, you know, you look at the names in that, that team and some of the NBA guys that you've idolised growing up and watched and, you know, to know I'm going into camp with them is, uh, is pretty sick. Yeah. Playing with guys that I enjoy playing with and with a coach and um, bringing success back to Wollongong. You know, last year was a bit of a disappointing year for us for the fans um, and I think we're putting together a good squad and you know we, we want to come out and play well and you know redeem ourselves a little bit and you know make Wollongong proud.